YouTube family. I had to do it. I had to do it. I had to review these bad boys. Like, I don't think y'all understand what... I mean, I'm not even gonna lie to you. I wasn't with the hype. I wasn't with the hype. I'm like, what is that? What is that? What is that supposed to be, right? I was one of those until I got a set of these bad boys. And let me tell you, like, So today, I'm going to review Dr. Squash. I can't even talk Harley because of... Ooh, that's a bad mother right there. Woo, that's bad right there. Okay, so my girlfriend, she got me three of these. Oh man. Whoo. Oh my goodness, that wood bear. Okay. So I got three of these. We gotta review these real quick. We got to. This is gonna be a quick, this ain't gonna be a long review. This is gonna be a quick review. We got the wood barrel bourbon, which is my favorite. I'm gonna let y'all know right off the bat is my favorite. I ain't gonna do like other people do it. Like, let me go ahead and tell you all of them, like, this one's my favorite. No, I'm gonna tell you right off the bat, this one is my favorite. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Dude, right here? Oh. <sighs> y'all stop playing with me. Y'all playing with my emotions right now. Y'all about to really irritate me. This right here. That's a damn shame. I can't even describe it. Woo! This right here. You know what? Out of all the flavors, I, I mean, not flavor, but all the smells I've tried, like I said, I got the Wood Barrel Bourbon, which I like bourbon anyways. Anything that's bourbon, I like it. Um, I got the Fresh Falls, which is right here. I haven't tried that one yet, but uh, that's the... This is Zero Grit. So this don't even have any grit on there. And let me tell you, that grit, oh my gosh, it does work. Get get something with some grit in there, okay? Get something with some grit in there. Uh, and then this right here is a medium grit, which is the Birchwood Breeze. Now, I don't mess with the Birchwood Breeze as much, okay? I don't mess with it as much. This one don't smell as strong to me, okay? Okay, so this one... I might mess with that Fresh Falls. I might mess with that, right? But the I'm seeing everything I'm smoking. This right here, that wood bourbon. Okay, so let me go ahead and tell you something about Dr. Squatch if you don't know it. I'm pretty sure you've seen the YouTube commercials, right? I don't pay attention to YouTube ads or commercials or whatnot because I find most of them redundant, repetitive, and it's the same bull crap. So I like them gurus will be sitting up there. And if you notice when you watch the guru, I'm going to say this real quick. Then we're going to get back to this. If you notice when you watch the guru ads, they all say the exact same lines. As if they all went to Kobayashi school and learned all the exact same lines to say within their ads. You know what I'm saying? Old boy probably taught him that too, because he's been doing this for almost 40 years. So, Tony Robbins. So, somebody taught them that, because they all say the exact same lines. Anyways, let's get back to the soap. So, this right here, this right here, this right here, right, right, right. So, it tells you what it smells like on the side. It says, smells like barrel-aged bourbon, which y'all not understanding what I'm talking about. Bro, I put this on. 
Unlike other soaps, which only smells good for like a few minutes. This soap lasts, I wouldn't say 24 hours, but I would say the smell of it lasted for at least five to six hours. And I was out in the heat. I went out in the sun and the smell was still good. I put on my mask and I can still smell it. And I was like, wow, you know what I'm saying? My girl, she smelt it. It smelt good to her. She loves it. See, I think she said this is her favorite one. This right here. So if you do mess with that, that squash, please do that. Okay, they got different. We're going to go through the different flavors that they got. But it tells you what it smells like on the side right here. So this one smells like Chris Forest Waterfall. Okay, so let's smell that one more time. Okay, that's probably, that probably I'm surprised she don't like that one. I'm surprised she don't like that one. That one's her favorite. Let's go ahead and open this up so we can see how it looks like. I'm not opening this up because y'all don't deserve that. Y'all don't, okay? You don't. All right. So let's go ahead. So it's basically just, they make, basically they make the soap in this big block, right? And then what they do is they use a machine that basically cuts and divides each into these squares, right? Now, at first I'm sitting here thinking, why is it not round or why is it not oval? Why is it not a certain shape? Then I thought that's what women like. We're men. We like squares. Okay? Apparently squares that turn on their own. The fuck? Okay. So basically, y'all needs to mess with this. Y'all really needs to mess with this. This this priest it and it's 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 like it's it was doing it again. Okay. But this basically what you do is you take this, you get it lathered up, you lather that bad boy up, okay? And you make sure you lather it up a lot. And I mean a lot, because it's gonna take a while to lather it up. Once you lather it up, then what you want to do is you want to basically Wipe your uh, self down just like regular soap at that point. Now remember, it's square. So for those of you who's not used to square soap, um, oh wow, that does smell good. Oh wow, that. Oh shit. Oh wow, that's Birch Park and Pumice Fiber. Oh wow, this Chris Burstwood's Forest. I, I didn't mind smelling like a forest. I'm not even gonna lie to you. I don't mind that. Wow, how do you, how do you make a forest smell good, bro? Touch my heart. Okay, so this right here. Mm, damn. Oh man, why she do this to me? <laughs> why she do this to me? I, I can't even put a review. I might as well just put a review reaction type thing. Because, oh my goodness. What the? Who does that? Why would you do that to people? Oh my God. That's just three of the many, many, uh, uh, uh. Like, like let's go through this list real quick. Let's go through what they got. Okay, so we see they got the Star Wars collection, the Batman collection, okay? Batman, you got the uh, Batman, it looked like Brig, and then the Riddler Enigma, okay? <laughs> I like how that did that. Then over here, you got the Star Wars collection. You got Star Wars 1 collection and Star Wars 2 collection, okay? It looks like Star Wars 2 collection is kind of based around Obi-Wan, Kenobi, Rey... Is that General Grievous? I can't tell. No, it's got to be another Darth character. And um, that looks like Darth Sidious. Okay. Hope I didn't get that wrong. Uh, and then over here you got Yoda. It looks like... Uh, is that Anakin? Or is it... It's hard. Let me just click on here. Because I don't want the Star Wars fans to just sit there and snap at me think I'm doing this on purpose. Because, you know, they had cut them. They had cut some people. Okay. Only Hope Soap. Wisdom Wash. Roofless Rinse. And Dark Side Scrub. Roofless Rinse. That is so funny. Roofless Rinse. How did I Yoda and Obi-Wan with zero grit? How are you, you going to do some stuff like that? 
And you see heavy grit. Well, of course, heavy grit. It's dark side. Like, of course, it's going to be heavy grit. What is heavy grit supposed to smell like? Oh, wow. That kind of looks good. And you got the ruthless rent. Of course, that got heavy grit. You got to have the heavy grit on there. You can't just not have heavy grit on there, okay? So let's go back uh, to, uh, okay, it, it, is it going to let us go back to product? Okay, so let's go down here. First off, we got the coconut castaway, which... I don't know. I'm glad they got a one in front of that. I will say that. I'm so glad there's a one in front of that. Um, let's see here. And then you got the pine tar and the bay rum. I want to try that bay rum. I want that bay rum. I bet it is fire. Okay. You got medium grit, heavy grit. That look like a zero grit. How you gonna have zero grit, bruh? Man, once you get that grit on there, it's like that's all you want. Cedar citrus. Ooh, I'm not sure I want to smell like oranges though. Uh, you got the cool fresh aloe. And then you got the alpine sage. Dude, I'm telling you, just using this soap, just think about using this soap alone. It takes you to a uh, 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 memory you didn't know you had. Then we got my favorite so far, the Wood Barrel Bourbon. I got the Fresh Falls, then Deep Sea Goat Milk, and then you got the Gold Moss, the Cold Brew Cleanse, and the Birchwood Breeze, which is what I also have right now. Then you got the Eucalyptus Greek Yogurt. I ain't know you want to put yogurt on your body. Uh, spearmint basil. Ooh, that probably smells fire. That probably smells fire. Walk around smelling. Grapefruit. I might want to try that one. Never smelled like grapefruit before. Yeah. Uh, then you got the soap saver. Oh, I need that. That soap saver. I need that. Then you got the crypto cleanse. Bruh, for real? Then you got the soap gripper. Uh, say no wash suds, no sticky residue, no wasted suds, no sticky residue. Okay, all right. I see how you is, uh, Doctor Swatch. You, you wrong for that. And then you got the book foot soap saver. You got the travel bag. Might need that travel bag. Might need it. Wait, which one's that? Grito Cleanse is out of stock? Wow. What the heck? Yo, when they said, yo, I'm not going to lie to you. Like, the way he looking right now in that video. Who gave him this clean cut right here? Who the hell gave him that clean ass cut? What's this for line right here? I'm, okay, that, that's, the, like a, that's some Decepticon looking type stuff right there. But anyways, yo. Get the soap. Every you got thousands of reviews. Heck, one of them got like, what was it? 5,475 reviews. Come on. Stop playing and go out there and try this stuff. Are you a man? If you're a man, go out there and get this soap. Get this soap. Ladies, if you love your man and you care about him. You would go and get him the soap. So go out there and give him that damn soap. So I'm going to go ahead and say, oh my gosh, bro. It's still on my nose, man. I can't do this no more. I can't do this no more. Like and subscribe. All right, then. That's probably the first time I ever said that. But all right, then. Y'all peace out. Stay safe. If I smack you in the face. And we out, man. We gone.